The group stages are winding down, but knockout football is still on offer. It's all to play for. Let's see how this one unfolds. All the drama and all the action coming up next on EA TV. Hello, it's great to be with you, and I don't think anybody is going to complain, especially about the weather. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone, and sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And it should be a big test for both countries. This is their second game at the Euros. It's two here. I think... Portugal moving the ball with purpose. Ronaldo! And there it is! The opening goal, the ideal way to start. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. Away again here, one nil the score. Mary Demiral, give him Arthur Kolu. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Chance for the Netherlands, and you've got to credit that magnificent piece of defending. Cristiano Ronaldo, and return to Fernandes. Who's 
Can. Yilmaz. They could really get at the opposition. Big chance to get them on terms. It was on its way in. And he has options available. It's for the go. And he's done it. Parate again. A magnificent game unfolding. Well, as you can see, he hits this with so much power. But just look at the follow through. So athletic. That's a dynamic strike. So the ball is rolling again at one all. Minch. On the ball, Rafael Leao. Determined to Bendik. Distributing it well. Well, he knows what he's doing defensively. comes to an end. The one thing about Bruno Fernandes in this game, Stuart, he's been oddly subdued. Well, he's had no real impact on the game so far. Yes, he's been tightly marked, but he has to work hard to make things happen. He's been really disappointing.
tasty encounter. Plenty of quality in those two sides. Certainly one to enjoy. Trumpston there. He's got acres of space. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. This has looked pretty good for the counter attack. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back. And I have to say, the finish from Ronaldo is just brilliant. He's such a good technician. It's a wonderful goal. Well, as they kick off again, 2-1 the current state of affairs. Akhtur Kolu. He wasn't going to let that go. Stadium and two very good teams. Ronaldo now was shot up and quick thinking defensively. Now the counter attack moves on. Well, they need to get bodies back. Attacking very much an option. Into the middle from Bernardo Silva. Under no real pressure, he has thinking time. And there is the goal to make it a hat trick. Excellence in finishing, there for all to see. Well, as you can see, the defending is really poor. But he won't mind. It's a simple finish for him.
Underway again with the score at 3 1. Bruno Fernandes has it. Went in strongly, decisively. Ten minutes to go then. Single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Now this can be productive. Chalhanolu, good forward back here, and a decent save. Full credit. Joao Cancelo. Now the silver. Ball's gone. this again the vision to play this through ball is superb and then the shot could not be hit any better struck with such venom great goal It is a win for Portugal, just what they were hoping for. Stuart, your overall assessment? Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today, but overall they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win.